Hello and welcome, ITTV Gaming here. In today's episode, I want to show you how to build this build, which is inspired by a real life temple. Now, I have obviously decided to add a little bit more tweaks to it than just making a regular temple. And honestly, I am very happy with the outcome of it, and it is very easy to build. So, if you want to build along, there will be a list in the description with the requirements. Also, if you want to download this, there will be a link for that as well. And if you don't, just sit back and enjoy. So to start off, we are going to outline everything. First, you want to have a sandstone block over here. And then you want to skip three blocks and then add another one. Do the same thing over here as well. So you want to have four in total on this side. And on this side, we are going to have, again, four of these same pillars. So here we go. You can just complete this square first. And after that, you want to replace the floor with some block of strip bamboo. Okay, once you got that in place, you want to build up each pillar by seven blocks. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. You want to do that for each one. And after that, you want to connect these two points as well. Okay, so you just want to go all the way around with some sandstone stairs. Okay, once you got that in place, what you want to do is you want to replace these center blocks with some slabs. And you can do this only at the front side. Okay, once that is in place, you want to add your stairs over here followed with some trap doors and we are going to do this for each one Okay, once you've got that in place, what you want to do is you want to go in one block over here and then add stairs going in like this. So you just want to create a simple balcony shape. And if you want to, you can do the same thing on this side just to make it symmetrical. Here we go. So this is not going to be anything fancy, just a simple balcony. Now this allows us to add some walls on the sides going down. So we are going to do that going all the way down till this point. Then you can get your gates and just place it in just like that. And if you want to, you can even open them up. So we are going to do this for each one. Now, if you want to, what you can do is adding a wall over here as well, just straight up going down. And we are going to do the same thing over on the opposite side. Okay, 
here we go. Then you just want to take your sandstone and fill it in on this side. Going all the way across. And after that, we are going to decorate the front side of this. Okay, then you just want to take the deep slay lapis lazuli and the deep slay redstone ore. And you just want to place it in in a order like this. It doesn't really matter how you do this. Now you do not need to do the same thing on the sides because this is not going to be visible. But if you want to be fancy, you can do it. Then you just want to add some full blocks on top and some stairs again. Okay, now let's add this same balcony shape over here as well. Okay, so first let's add some full blocks over here. And then let's do the same thing on this side. Then we can just again take the sandstone wall. Just basically go down. Add a full block. Just make sure that this lands exactly on this block. And we can do the same thing over here. And don't worry, once we get going, this will look all fine. For now, it looks a little bit off, but don't worry about it too much. Now we can do the same thing on this side and over here as well. Full block, another full block. Just build it all up. So now let's decorate this side a little bit more. So first you just want to add some stairs going in. Just like this. After that, you want to add a gold block at the center. Then take the bamboo trapdoor and place it in. You can even do it on the sides as well if you want to. Then over here, you just want to add a glowstone followed with a trapdoor. Add a wall on top followed with a lantern. Okay, over here we are going to do the almost the same thing. So you just want to add some walls going up. And after that you can take the gates again and then place it in. Now if you want to, you can even fill this. Okay, so let's replace it with a slab and over here as well. Okay, then we can just continue adding the gates. Now, if you want to, you can even do the same decoration on the opposite side, but I'm not going to do it. The only thing I'm going to change about it is the stairs. So you just want to add your stairs and then after that you can add the close zone and the trapdoor. Okay, then the corners, what you want to do is you want to replace this with a full block and this as well, followed with a wall. Now you can do this for each side. Okay, once that is all in place, you can just continue with the fences. Okay, so to start off, you just want to add a full block over here and go up and in. Let's do the same thing over here. Okay, once that is done, what you want to do is you just want to add an additional slab on the sides. Take your stair, place it in, do the same thing on the opposite side. And then add another stair facing into this block over here. You can do the same thing on this side. Now if you want to, you can repeat this over here as well.
Then take your slabs and go all the way across. Okay, once that is done, you just want to have walls going up over here at the center and on this side. Let's repeat it quickly over here as well. Okay, on the back side of the walls, you just want to go up with some close sound. Okay, then on top, you just want to add some gold blocks. Over here, you just want to place some redstone. Uh, well, actually, deep slayer redstone. And over here, you just want to have regular redstone blocks. Place another gold block over here and over here as well. Okay, then on the side, you want to have a diamond block followed with a deep slayer gold ore. Now, you just want to repeat the same thing over on this side as well. Okay, once that is done, you just want to add a wall over here and another wall on this side. Okay, and after that, we are going to add some stairs again, but facing outwards. So let's take some stairs. And then, like I said, you just want to start over here, go in and have a simple arch shape like that. Let's repeat it over here as well. And then one more on top of this going in and up. And then take a bamboo fence and place it in as well. Okay, then we are going to add one more wall on these sides. Okay, now you can repeat the same thing on the opposite side. Okay, once that is done, we are going to cover the roof, which is going to be quite simple. We are going to extend the slabs and the stairs just to meet each point. Once you're done with all of that, what you want to do is you want to add some extra stairs on the sides, just to give it a little bit more depth. Okay, then take a end rod and place it in on the sides, just like that. And I'm going to end only add two of it, not too much. Now, you just want to make sure that this, then add another set on the back side of this, and you can do the same thing over here as well. Okay, then take some buttons and place it in as well. Okay, then what you want to do is you just want to dig out a pathway. So we're going to do it very simple. You just want to get rid of this. Now on the sides, I'm going to use smooth stone. Then at the center, I will use some cobblestone stairs. And you just want to make sure that you have two blocks of space on each side, just like this. Okay, so first I'm going to fill in all of this and after that we're going to decorate it as well.
Okay, once we're done with that, you just want to extend this a little bit. There we go. And after that, you can just take your water and just place it in. Okay, now on the side, we are going to have some walls going in as well. Go then add another extra wall on the sides. Okay, you can replace these blocks with a water source. Then the edge, we are going to go with some bamboo trapdoor just to add the same color as we have done over here. Okay, now you want to make sure that this is the same amount of space. We got three over here and we got two over here, so we need to extend this out by one more. And after that, you can just continue the walls. Okay, so let's add some leaves on the sides going up. Okay, after that you can just add some roses and some blue orchids if you want to you can add different flowers to this but i'm going to keep it as it is okay now once that is done you can just go ahead this up as well if you do not want to make this too flat you can just add some leaves over here randomly as well and then obviously you can again add some flowers so this is going to be very straightforward I will add two torch flowers on the sides as well. Okay, so let's decorate the interior a little bit as well. So you just want to add your stairs going across. Okay, then you just want to add some fences at the corners and then just light this all up with a lantern. Okay, you can do the same thing on top as well. And then just fill this all in with some fences. And here we go. Now we can definitely add a lot more decoration to this if you want to, but I really like the simplicity of it. So I'm going to keep it as this and hopefully you all enjoyed this one. And if you did, please leave a like and subscribe. Have a nice day. I'll see you the next time.